Okay, so hello everybody, welcome back to my channel today. Today we are back to our business topic. So, our topic today is talking about that did you crossing the line? Oh, I'm sorry, I'm changing the camera angles. So, today our topic is talking that about the difficulty with just sticking into the law and why that we cannot just stick into the laws and don't go into see the other side of it. So, I'm going to go straight into our topic today. So, the difficulty of just sticking to the laws that the law is not the thing that cover every situation. So, the things that the line between <clears throat> what is legal and illegal isn't always clear as you think. And sometimes, maybe something that is better if you're watching about if it's fair or not, you can go into compare that if it's legal or not. There are two types, fair equal legal, unfair equal unlegal and fair with unfair create a mix called the gray place so let's go straight into the examples for examples the ethnic is just not about the way that business is going to making but it's also depending on what behave that the people in that business do for examples that about fair or unfair so our examples is talking about a manager talking with her staff, uh, his staff about that the staff forgot to lock the safe. So there are two situations. The first one, the manager tell the staff that, oh, you forgot to lock the safe last night. Please don't do it again. So at this time, he's talking fair gently and very very good because why because he making the staff understand his mistake and his permit to not going to let him down again the gray place which means that the second situation about he talking with to the man, uh, the staff like before but not the gently word but like how you be so stupid you are the best stupid employer that i have had so for examples like that so the manager talking like that for the staff and in mind the staff say why is he so rude i don't like this job but outside he was still saying that i'm really sorry i will going to make it don't let uh, don't happen again i'm sorry so that's how the manager talking not have an exactly fair or unfair and the last one is about the unfair situation which means that the illegal one so instead of talking gently or just talking that they are stupid like it's not so hard he's going to swear going to do everything but and thus make the staff become so angry why because he think that i'm sorry about the way i don't lock in the safe but you shouldn't be bullying me i need to find lawyers so that way you see that he going to be angry and the situation become better. So this is how that the things that we can cross the line walking, which means that you have to watching that even though it's legal or not, you have to do it fair. Or you can be a little bit unfair, but not always 100%, which means that you have to mix 50% unfair and 50% fair. That way, maybe people will just not going to find a lawyer to go into like they come back with you but if you do it fair it's still better because if you do 100% fair people will believe in you and they will try to make you happy because they know that you just want your good for them for examples so that's come to our second part that the good ethic is a good business so sometimes or you can say always almost always getting managers to be have fairly and gently encourage all of the staff in a business to work well because the scientists have proved that when people are calm and happy they tend to work in better and more effective so in turn to make more money for the business they can make the business become more better because they are feeling happy and try to make the manager happy too so good ethic is will going to hand in hand with good business practice 
and that's all about the way that a manager or also a boss should do with the staff. Even though you, I have said before that you don't need to act 100% fair, but if you act like that, the staff will very like you and they will still trying to do everything for you. But if you do a little bit unfair, not 100%, but you can miss some percent of fair and unfair. So it will make the staff not really going to like you and not really help you, but they still doing their job. And if you are completely unfair, which means completely illegal in some law of the country like American, that if you are going to talk something too bad, it's going to be illegal. So for that, maybe you can make your staff think that you are too bad and they cannot give up. So you have cut one of your people in your business. So that's not a good way to make your business grow. And this on of the things that I want to say today. Thank you for listening and I will see you guys in the next video. And now it's time for me to check up. Bye-bye.